If you are enjoying this series or my channel, be sure to subscribe and leave a like. Comment your thoughts on the video or whatever you like. Make sure it's positive and you'll get a reply from yours truly. Lastly, follow my Instagram and my Twitter. Links are always in the description below. And if you're enjoying my daily content, be sure to share it to your friends and family. Commander, we're there you go. Position indefensible. We're not gonna make it. I'm sending help. Hold tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. I didn't know Legion was over here, so I forgot to add this at the end of the last video. Shepard Commander, you opposed Creator Admiral Zen's attempt to confiscate our platform. She's done enough already. Your assistance continues to be noted. You say Geth fighters are targeting the Quarian's live ships? Hostile Geth fighter squadrons intend to breach the live ship's defenses. The assigned squadrons are networked with server on Rannoch. If the live ships are damaged, the creators will lose armaments, provisions, people. So we destroy the server? No, Geth programs would transfer to alternate servers. They are only vulnerable through direct interface. Okay. Removing Geth from this server will prevent significant creator deaths. We will accompany you on this mission. Back on the Dreadnought, you mentioned Geth heretics. What exactly happened to them after we blew up that satellite? Rewriting the heretics increased the number of Geth allied with the old machines. This has resulted in a greater number of hostile Geth platforms. So you're saying it was a mistake? It has put us at a tactical disadvantage. This was not a foreseen outcome, but we cannot change a decision once it is made. Do you harbor regrets about rewriting the heretics? The Quarians hit first. If we get rid of the Reaper signal, maybe this war doesn't have to end with everyone destroyed. An interesting notion. Most organics would not hold on to ideals of peace for so long. The Geth have fought the Quarians before. What made this different? The Geth were building a megastructure to house all Geth, store all memories. It was to end our isolation from each other. And the Quarian flotilla attacked it? Yes. A significant amount of programs were installed when creators began bombing. We did not have sufficient surplus hardware to save them all. Some programs could not be recovered. Is that what made the Geth desperate enough to work for the Reapers? Yes. Imagine that for every one of your people lost on Earth, your own intelligence dimmed. The Creator's attack narrowed the Geth's perspective. Self-preservation took precedence. You were afraid you'd be wiped out. We do not experience fear as you would, but we have no desire to be exterminated. Even if the Reapers cost the Geth free will? That is evidently an acceptable trade. So what happened to you? What did you do after you left the Normandy? Our physical platform returned to the Geth consensus beyond the Perseus Vale. Data gathered during our mission confirmed that the old machine's return was imminent. We planned for war. So the Geth believed your proof that the Reapers were coming back? Of course. That must have been nice. We'll talk later. We will remain here. So this little situation that's going on right now, it's a little difficult because, as you see, the creators of the Geth, aka Legion's people, well, you know, Geth as in Legion's people and the creators as in the Quarians, are having a war again with each other. And having another war while the Reapers are attacking, it's kind of not good to have right now. So I'm trying to end their war so we can... Have everybody join our alliance and we can all work together to take out the damn Reapers. But they are all so damn stubborn because everyone wants to live, but they all want to kill each other. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? And it's kind of tricky and it's, it's risky to have Geth because they're always getting overrun and used by the Reapers. So, like, it's kind of hard to trust them, but I trust Legion since he's my homie and he does have a mind of his own. But the other people, you know, know it's kind of difficult. The Cure. All right.
right, Jacob wants to meet up in the hospital, okay. Alright, so we're here, we're here. What up, Jacob, you wanted to talk about something? something? No? Bro, you sent me an email to come here. I'm glad we had time to talk. I came here you and you don't want to talk. Gotta take the moments when you can. What up? Hey, Commander. Sounds like you guys had a crazy ride over there. Yeah. You could say that. Sorry I missed it. And that Geth Legion. I know you two have a past, but... You sure we can trust it? Legion's not like other Geth. We can trust it. If you say so. I guess you can't always judge an individual by their... Species. Look at Sparks. If all the Quarians were like her, we wouldn't be stuck refereeing their war with the Geth. Sparks? Yeah, your Quarian friend. The jumpy one with the glowing eyes. Sparks. Uh-huh. He's talking about Crazy that, that they picked now to start a fight. But I guess the end of life is we know it can make everybody a little loco. Just a little? Hey, not everybody's as crazy as you, sir. Wait, I can... What? Would you look at this? Fam, I'm out here... What? I didn't know I could upgrade my pistol. I'm about to be brawling, bro. Too bad you weren't here earlier, Tally. You've just missed Rex. I heard. I can't believe the genophage is really cured. Shepard's on a roll. I figure if we can pull that off, we've got a shot at sorting the Geth out. I don't know. The genophage didn't carry rifles and fight back. No, but there was a scary bit with the mother of all Thresher Maws. The what? Long story. Nobody will believe it anyway. With you, Garrus, I'd believe just about anything. No. Oh. <laughs> we should play poker sometime. Anyway, it's good to have you back. Now, believe it or not, this damn gun still needs calibrating. That's funny. Shepard, you just knew the Geth would figure into this war somehow. Because Reapers weren't enough. Still, it's good to have Tally here. This is as much her fight as ours. Any word from Palavin? Some, and I don't like what I'm hearing. The Krogan are there, in force, but they're just slowing the Reapers down, not stopping them. I'm not sure it's going to be enough. You hear anything from your family? But I did hear from Primarch Victus. He wanted my advice on fleet strength when the Crucible is ready. Still can't get used to people asking me things like that. What did you say? I said, at some point, we're going to have to decide if our fleets keep defending Palavin or we go on the offensive. Can't do both? Not with the beating we're taking. Like I said, not the sort of questions I'm used to answering. You know what you're doing, Garrus. Trust me, everyone can see that. Maybe. But you spend so much time on the outside trying to get in, and when you do, it's... not what I expected. How so? All the questions, and every one of them with a million lives riding on the answer. You do the best you can with what you know. It's no different than your days at CSEC. You're right. Though I'm starting to understand why the galaxy needs cold-hearted dictators every now and then. They get things done? They don't give a damn about the consequences. Suppose that's what it's going to take, Shepard. The ruthless calculus of war. Ten billion people over here die, so twenty billion over there can live. Are we up for that? Are you? If we reduce this war to arithmetic, we're no better than Reapers. A nice sentiment. Let's hope we can live by it. It got deep just now. What the heck? Oh, Alright. Let's just get straight back into the mission. I am curious. I couldn't uh, believe it when Shepard told me you were on the Normandy. It appears I have that effect on humans. Now Quarians as well, it seems. For what it's worth, Quarians understand what it's like to lose your home. As I understand, that was your own fault. What do you mean? In my cycle, Quarians didn't need helmets to survive. You were the masters of your own planet. That was a long time ago. And if you hadn't given birth to the machines, you would still breathe the air that evolution intended. I see. Liara warned me you weren't what she expected. And nothing about this cycle is what I expected. Even primitive Quarians were considered attractive in my age. 
A pity no one can appreciate it now. Right. You know what? I think I have something important to do now. I won't keep you. Damn, this guy got the mean attitude. But yeah, so apparently, what he just said right there, he, he said that the quarries are attractive. Apparently they are attractive without that helmet? I mean, we're not chasing Tally, but I'm curious to know how she looked like without a helmet. They're called Geth. Yes, a formidable opponent. Why did you allow one on this ship? Legion helped us before. It's still a machine. I take it you had your own problems with AI? The Jatil. They were as the Geth are to this cycle. What happened? The creators lived on a dying world. It was beyond their ability to save. So they resorted to implants to enhance their intelligence. I think I know where this is going. The AI sees the physical body. It could alter the genetic material at the deepest level. In time, the offspring were molded into a slave race. Few organic traces were left. They were monsters. All machines commit treachery. The one you brought on board is no different. Maybe. But he's not like the other Geth. You can't know that. They are more alien than you and I are to each other. Just because Legion isn't like us doesn't mean he can't be trusted. You're wrong. Throw it out the airlock. How can you be that certain? Organics do not know how we were created. Some say by chance, some say by miracle. It is a mystery. But synthetics... No, we created them. And they know we are flawed. Why do you say that? They are immortal. We are not. They see time as an illusion. We are trapped by its limitations. Above all, machines know the reason they were created. And we don't. They serve a purpose, while we search aimlessly for ours. In their eyes, organics have no reason to exist. Do not trust them, Commander. I can't believe there isn't some way for us to coexist. We made them. And then gave them the power to surpass you. There is room for only one order of consciousness in the galaxy. The perfection of the machines or the chaos of the organics. Throw the machine out of the airlock, Commander. What the hell? I have a simple rule. If a machine can speak, kill it. Yo. That's deep, guys. You see that? What are we talking about over here? The Turians will hold. Pound for pound, they're the best fighting force in the galaxy. Pound for pound is irrelevant, given the significantly higher mass of Reaper forces overall. That's why we're bringing in the Krogan. Good to have Tally back, even if it's just for a bit. Adams is good, but I never feel like the engine's running right without Tally around. Kind of a good luck charm. As for the rest of the Quarians, though, are we okay with them blowing up a ship with you on it? Hell no. We are not. Right. Just making sure. Different standards and all. And you found Legion! He's still wearing that piece of your armor? Because that wasn't creepy at all. Shepard, the Get continue to block Quarian access to the mass relay. The Normandy stealth drive is allowing us to remain undetected. Wait, but if he's... Right. All right you can hit on. the Quarian homeworld or get out of system whenever you want. Just let us know. Okay. So you see how he said if it if a machine talks, kill it? Does Edie count as that then too? He wants he might want us to kill Edie too then. This guy's moving mad. Edie, anything? No? Alright, let's get out of here. Shepard, about seventy two hours ago the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Scans of the station are cold, it's deserted. What happened to the troop station there? Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. Captain Riley's on site, doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. Okay. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good, hack it out. See you there. Well, not you, but I'll do it. <laughs> 
Commander, Corporal Nyrek reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. All right. Gladly. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. Been through thick and thicker. The captain always sees us through. Uh, where's Riley at? Is this Riley? You Riley? Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting oh, access. Oh, I know this mission. This mission is annoying. Not possible. Where the heck is Riley? Or one of you Riley? Oh, that's soldier. Riley. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two nice teams. Nice and smooth. Roger that. that. Yo, what material is that? That material looks like smooth. Yes, restart. you know it. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Yeah, this is gonna be a fun, guys. Just Work, saying. Coslo. I'll take it from here. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. Team two, moving out, Commander. Good luck, Captain. Something's wrong here. It's too quiet. What determines your personal threshold for quiet? All this technology shouldn't be so dead. Just stay sharp, people. Good? Are we good? I think we good, right? There you go. Yeah, I, I think we good. I have a visual good. on the fuel rod control, but radiation is blocking access. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. Is this it right here? This looks like ventilation control. Should do the trick. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. Ugh, this mission's gonna Let's be unlock those fuel rods. Out of all the missions, I remember that. I remember this one. Uh, all right. Power is restored. System ready. Awesome. Fuel rods unlocked here. Wait a minute. Commander, Captain, checking movement in your areas. Defensive positions. Enemy inbound. We're ready for them. Uh, we got husk out of all things to spawn. We get a husk. Seriously? Warning. Coolant leaks detected. What? Wait, what? I can see it. Both have to seal all the moderator tanks. All right. I'm assuming this is one. Tank one is sealed and stable. All right. Now I gotta head to the second one, right? Only one more to go here. All right, I got both of them. What now? Commander, the core is stabilized. Reactivation could go ahead. Riley, you in position? Affirmative. Awaiting your word. Edie, let me see that ass real quick. Bam. Just needed motivation to keep doing this mission. Commander, Captain, Don't tell Joker though. Incoming. Progress. Enemy sighted. Where? Back up off me, ugly. Go to sleep, ugly. Oh, get off of her! What? You doing? You alright? You alright? He saw that ass. He was like, alright, let me grab it too. Nah, man, you wildin'. You can't get none of this, boy. That's Joker and mine to look at. Beep! She got that Summer Ray ass. Oh, I'm dead. Uh, you can't sabotage them. Oh my god, I'm sorry. They're not robots. Darn it. If I know I'm dealing with robots, I need Tally with them. We're not dealing with robots. We don't really need Tally. Why are you guys here? You guys are Reaper freaking monsters. Is that everything? Everyone's dead? Nope, I hear that. He's spitting right now. Oh, there he is. Beep. Yeah, see? Now everyone's dead. There you go. I'm sending help. Hold tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. Uh, I'll send Tally. Tally? I'm on it. Oh! Only reason why I kept Edie is because I know Edie's powers are OP. And I like Edie. Where? How'd you fit a bro? Say goodbye. 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 Get out of here. You're trash. You're trash. You're trash. That's it. You're trash. Even though my pistols are pretty, pretty strong right now. They're doing a lot more damage than... What they were doing before, look at that. I don't really need to change weapons actually. You're clear for the moment, Commander. You can't raise Captain Riley. What about Tally? Nothing, Commander. No one's answering my hail. But I'm tracking some movement toward the pickup point. Finalize the restart, then we can rendezvous there. We'll do. Alright. 
Alright, I guess that's it. Gonna be in here? Will I die? No? So, what happened to Tally? Alright, I guess hopefully we'll see them at the end. Tally, you good? Oh! Everyone's okay! What the hell? Commander, you saved our asses. My team is in your debt. Thank Tally. It was the least I could do. Alright, ready to go home? Let's Job go well home. Done. Report back to the shuttles. Good work down there, Shepard. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. I'll keep you posted on new developments. Hack it out. 